This is Jeffrey Hebner in court on February 1st, facing 26 counts, including rape, sodomy, sex abuse, public indecency, and solicitation. It all stems from his alleged activity as the owner of Dream Girls Espresso, a bikini barista stand on Tualatin Valley Highway in Hillsborough. At the time, police described his actions from 2015 to November of last year as a criminal abuse of power against young women and said, It is likely that there could be others out there. That was telling. In court paperwork connected to a release hearing this week, prosecutors wrote, Since this case has been pending, 14 more women have reached out to law enforcement and the investigation is ongoing. They also laid out specifics of the allegations made against Hebner, much of it too graphic to describe here fully. Prosecutors say it started with job applicants tricked into going not to the coffee stand, but to Hebner's home for an interview, where they were informed the barista job included nudity and performing in a sexual way for customers and were told to disrobe. In one such instance this past November, prosecutors say D, for the defendant, offered KC shots of liquor and lines of cocaine, ultimately forcibly touched KC all over her body and attempted to rape KC, but she was able to physically block him with her leg. The 19-year-old KC ultimately left and made a report to police that got the case going. Prosecutors say the abuse and exploitation continued for employees at the coffee stand, where several women described the regular occurrence of naughty coffee orders. Those required them to expose their bodies and provide a sexual performance for customers who paid extra fees. The young women told prosecutors hundreds of dollars could be made in a single shift and that Hebner got a cut of the money and often got naughty coffees himself. In conclusion, prosecutors wrote Hebner preyed on particularly vulnerable young women. Writing, for years, he believed he was getting away with horrific acts of sexual abuse, that he was untouchable. Now Hebner's in jail with bail set at 700000 Tim Gordon, KGW News.